Ahead of the upcoming uh, school year, Lamers Bus Lines is out looking for drivers. Local 5's Aaron Taylor shows us how the company is making this push to get enough drivers on the road in time for back to school. I started driving in 2019, so two years. I was just looking for something part-time to do because I have two kids. Michelle says bus driving works for her because she gets to drop off and pick up her oldest from school every day and take her youngest along for the ride. We get to hang out and have a great time, and then we just get back on our route in the afternoon and pick up the rest of our kids, and then we're home by 4.30 in the afternoon. Before the school year starts in September, Lemers is hoping to find more drivers to join Michelle on the road. Right now, I'd say we're about looking for about 40 drivers at just this location. That's a lot of drivers to find in a short amount of time. This is kind of an unprecedented shortage. And officials with Lamers say the coronavirus pandemic is to blame. People were kind of scared. Um, you know, they wanted to basically be safe, which I don't blame them one bit, but we had a, a lot of older drivers just retire. The company is holding an open house at locations across the state to try to fill those roles. New drivers must pass a background check and be at least 21 with a good driving record. Four years experience driving is also required, but it doesn't have to be a large vehicle. It's a 40 foot bus. It's different from driving a vehicle. Um, but Lamers does a great job at training. And if you've never tried, they're offering up a chance to check it out. It's kind of a bit intimidating, but uh, we're hoping that we can actually get you behind the wheel um, in a setup course here at Lamers. The folks here at Lamers even let me get behind the wheel. Because if I can do it, you might be able to get the hang of it too. I feel powerful. In Menasha, Aaron Taylor, Local 5 News. All right, open houses will be held from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. at Lamers locations all across the state. For more information on the event, just look under the local news tab of our website at wearegreenbay.com.